Pisces, hi guys, you are the last reading of the day. It is now very, very dark out. I did start early this morning, and then I went to do some energy work for others, and then I came back to finish the reading, because once I'm in a mode of doing the readings, I have to finish it that day. It's just something that I promised myself. Pisces, you're the last one. Let's make it good. What's around Pisces, God? Please show me what's around Pisces. Please email me for yourself at psychictracybrown at yahoo.com. Tracy spelled T-R-A-C-E-Y, psychictracybrown at yahoo.com. Please subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get to 10,000. And thank you for all those who have already subscribed. What is around Pisces? It's around Pisces, God. Good, 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 good. It's around Pisces, God. Let's do this. I love you, Father God. I love you, Jesus. Thank you, and please show me what's around Pisces. Ah, see, some major changes are coming into your life, and you should hear about these changes in about about three months time but it's major i have to tell you pisces take it with both hands it's an opportunity it's coming quick it's coming fast you don't have time to think you're gonna want to jump on it anyway um but i also feel like it's going to be really really good for you i also believe it's a matter of do or die which means if you don't hop on this opportunity, you will have regret for the rest of your life. And if you have regret for the rest of your life, Pisces, you will make everybody around you suffer. So, when this opportunity comes up, don't procrastinate. Don't run from it. Just take it. Take it. Remember, you can always come back. You can always figure something else out. But... You will regret not taking this opportunity. With that being said, this is you, Pisces. The opportunity comes up and you want to talk about it with everyone. And you're going to have people say to you, what about me? That involves a lover. It's a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn person whose heart you're going to break. It looks like you're going to be pretty stubborn about it, though. You know what I mean? You may be forced to be stubborn about it. Because the way this decision comes is there really is no time to think. Really is not any time to think. It's almost like, I'll give you a good example, but I don't think this is your, your case. It's almost like being in the military and you have three choices. Japan, Hawaii, North Korea. And... Your superiors aren't giving you the opportunity really to have a conversation with your loved ones. All right? Not really. And they're kind of impressing upon you that you have three choices, but you really only have one choice, and that's North Korea. You would rather go to Hawaii. But they're also giving you North Korea and giving you extra money and extra benefits and you know whatever else could go with going to that particular country but you want to be able to talk it over with somebody and yet you know when you talk this over with anybody your relationship your parents your friends everybody is going to be like don't do it don't do it and you know you don't have a choice and you ultimately make the choice without the discussion and then you go back and say, I made a choice. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I see.
Um, whatever this is, it's going to actually, you know, Pisces, it's different for you. Whatever this is, it's different for you. And you might be making this choice because it's so different for you, because this is so new for you. It's almost a choice that people wouldn't expect you to make. They're going to be like, you, you're going where? You, you did what? what? What happened? Something like that. And, or it's going to be like, that actually happened? Like, you talked about it, but it actually came true? Something like that. And it's a pride thing. All of a sudden, it's almost like you have to do it. And unfortunately, you would drop a relationship to do this. Whatever this is. I picked military as an example of something that needed to happen swiftly. And then you make a decision and then later you discuss it. That's what this card represented. But this discussion, in a weird kind of way, is not a discussion. You're going to already make up your mind. You're already going to do it. All right? Also, for some Pisces, there could be a triangle out there. There's a little bit of a triangle. Um, for, for men, it's a fire sign woman. And for women, it will be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn man. Who could help make this decision better for you. Because it's kind of like, it's not my fault, not my fault. Um, but then actually gets you out of this relationship. There is pain involved because whoever you're involved with, there might be a, 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 an extra party out there that could help make this decision uh, better. And you, you kind of don't get into trouble for it because it's like, it's not my fault. I took this job. <laughs> Pisces, little snakes, a little sneaky there. Um, but you know what? I'm not getting it as a bad thing this time for Pisces. There's been a couple other signs that I felt like, oh, geez, not getting it for Pisces. You know, Pisces, I'm going to say this. Do what feels right to you. Do what feels right to you. And I'm not kidding. Do what feels right. Um, many Pisces are going to get pregnant um, in the month of May. Conce conception occurs in the month of May. Many Pisces that get that conceive in the month of May um, may have some uh, labor and delivery issues. Okay? So many Pisces who conceive in the month of May could have C-sections. Could have some labor or delivery issues. Could be a decision that needs to be made quickly. Again, Pisces and these quick decisions. Um, and could wind up having a C-section. Uh, many, many Pisces who conceive in the month of May, many will have a girl. Watch your money, Pisces. All right? Watch your money. Um... Also, Pisces, be really, really careful that, that you compromise your, your, there's some sabotage that's coming back to the home, sabotage that's coming back to the home. So, Pisces, watch your mental health because there's some unclear things that are going on with, you know, with, with Pisces. Pisces, you're going to find love. Literally, well, you find sex first, sex, sex, and then love. So sex, you probably, Pisces, probably all sleep way too fast with each other. I mean, not, I mean, with, with the opposite sex, you probably dive in first. Sex first turns to love, which actually is going to be a way for you. Oh, Pisces. All right. Yeah, Pisces is going to get pregnant. And there's different dynamics I see here. Single Pisces are going to get pregnant. And it will be a conflict. Pisces that are in a relationship. Um, there's also a conception in the month of May. Do you understand the difference? <laughs> Singles get pregnant. 
This is a shock. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Um, but those who are in a relationship will conceive in a month of May. But those that conceive in a month of May will most likely have labor and delivery issues and may wind up with a C-section. All right, Pisces, for the most part, it's a good month. Again, if there's a decision that needs to be made, I'm going to authorize Pisces to do what they feel is best for them. There are some hurt feelings that's going to come out of this, but it's very, very important for Pisces to do what they feel is right. The decision could involve somebody else, which means there might be an outside component that's helping you to make this decision because that's what they want to but it also means hurting someone beyond that there are many pisces that's going to get pregnant in the month of may you will have labor and delivery issues there are also are going to be many pisces that will uh have a pregnant uh pregnancy uh, uh, uh announcement um, but may not be happy about it um, and watch your money for the month of uh, May, Pisces. Also, for the ones that are going to get pregnant, it doesn't look like a pregnancy. It looks, it comes across as an illness, comes across as um, food poisoning, and lo and behold, it'll be a pregnancy. And that's for the more single ones, not the ones that are actually looking and okay with having a baby. These are the, these are the fast and furious, you know, <laughs> twenty year olds. Your bunnies out there. <laughs> I don't even know where I got that. <laughs> I cracked myself up. All right, guys. Love, love, love. Thank you for putting up with me, Pisces. Not a bad reading, Pisces, and I'm. Really happy for you guys. So keep me posted. Email me for your own personal reading. Psychic Tracy Brown at yahoo.com.